Hey science, take a look at this. It's vlogging day 715. Morning. It is Sunday and I'm gonna go see Rachel on her last day at the Peloton before she moves on to brighter and sunnier days. Although it's really bright and sunny as it is uh, here in Paris. So I don't know if leaving here is necessarily the best idea if you want to get more sun because it's gonna be hard to do about as much sun as you're gonna get around here. Anyways, these are the glasses that Movement sent me. The problem is they keep sending me non-polarized glasses. So probably won't ever wear them. I asked them for the polarized ones. Although actually maybe these ones don't, to be fair, now that I think about it, these ones may not have come polarized. Uh, I don't know, what's the point of wearing non-polarized sunglasses? These are basically just tinted glasses at the end of the day. Which is what Jeff was accusing these glasses of being. But at least these are polarized. I don't know, the magic of these glasses might have been ruined as well. I feel like I got a lot of progress done yesterday. Uh, sorry for those of you who watched my Instagram stories that thought that I had gotten the bed from my room. I had not. Those of you wondering, the stairs do double as storage. They're like drawers going up and then a bunch of them can be hollow so you can put stuff in them. So it's actually going to be pretty nice to have. I'm really looking forward to that coming to fruition. Here's hoping it happens sooner than later. In the meantime, let's, let's go get coffee. We'll figure it out from there. A little devious plotting session with our resident Parisian podcaster. Guilty as charged. <laughs> what have I done? What have I done wrong? So many things. Am I being filmed? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> he's an audio guy, but uh, he's he's handsome enough for film. To be honest. Uh, yeah, man. Good to see you. I'm gonna. Good to see you, man. Good to see you. Good chats with that guy. He's always brainstorming, always thinking, planning, and plotting. So I'm gonna try and go read for a bit, I think. I'm gonna find some food, go sit in a park and read for a bit before this uh, party tonight that I have to film at Jean Yves. And then we'll see what happens there too. thing figured out because I'd love to have a comfortable space to sit and read here. It'd be really nice. It's good to sit outside for a little bit, but it's hot. Scorcher. Uh, I'm gonna get a little bit of work done, I think, and then I've gotta go to, oh, I totally forgot I turned Do Not Disturb mode on on my phone last night. Well, there you go, turn that off. Uh, I'm gonna head to Jean Yves here in a little bit. Go to his place, make a little video for him for his website as well. I'm not, I really wanna make videos for other people. It's not something I really wanna be doing, but he's a friend and, uh, Good to help him out a little bit. He's paying me a little bit to do that, so full disclosure on that front as well. But going and getting a tasty meal and meeting some people tonight sounds okay. And then I'm hoping to be completely antisocial and rest centric for the first half of this upcoming week and get back to my plotting and devising plans. And I want to turn on my fan, which I can't do until I stop recording. So I'm gonna go ahead and get some work done, and then we'll we'll head out to Johnny's place. Did you even know that I left the river until I walked through the door? No, no idea because I'm hot. I don't know. What's about? One of the things that I'm trying to figure out, and I think I'm going to address in the next couple days, is like, <laughs> what is my current emotional state? I'm having a hard time figuring it all out. I'm still a little bit confused, and I'm just tired and jet lagged as well. So I'll be thinking a lot more about that over the next couple days, as well as trying to parse out what the future holds, plans, goals. It's a lot to think through right now. But tonight, we'll just limit it to uh, you know delicious food and hopefully some good conversations and hopefully a good night's sleep, and we'll we'll catch up to the whole rest thing here shortly. 
tend to forget how tired I really am. You know, until it hits me really hard. But yeah, up until that point, like when I'm walking around, I'm not thinking about it that much. It's kind of like a spicy breaded sausage. Anyways, we're all kind of mingling, hanging out. I really don't have the energy to socialize tonight that much. I'm gonna try to, do my best. I mean, I'll film, kind of hang out on the edges a little bit. So I'm just feeling kind of emotionally and socially exhausted right now. I'll put it together soon. It's like an Asian pig in a blanket. <laughs> I'm